It's like sounding out here. That sounds a little bad. It sounds. What's wrong with it? it sounds fine. <laughs> That's that sounds fine to you, right? No. <laughs> Can you feel it now? When we dance through the stars. Steve is making a massive mistake today. Steve, what are you doing? What are you talking about, dude? Dude, you know exactly what I'm talking no, about. No, I'm not even putting that on. You're today. not putting it on. So Steve O has decided to not make a massive mistake today because he's a very smart person and I like him very much. In reality, it's not really much of a mistake at all. I'm just kind of giving him crap for it. He's got some mob grip tape right here and he's gonna be putting it on his scoot over there, but he's not just taking off any sheet of grip tape. He's taking off vital grip tape. It's a sad day, ladies and gentlemen. It's a sad day. <laughs> But we are out here at Cal Oak Skate Park today. We're gonna be hanging at the local today just to have a little bit of fun. Gonna be riding, gotta rebuild my scoot. We're probably gonna have to give some stickers out to Michael. Right, Michael, you want some stickers? He wants, he wants stickers. So one of my favorite things to do when I do get to the skate park and I take the vlog out is I, I like to make kids learn things that they absolutely never thought that they could have done previously. So Jess, he's our candidate for the day. What's up, Jess? How's your day going? Well, no. It's great! Uh, Jess, you're gonna learn how to firecracker today. And if you guys don't know what a firecracker is, I will demonstrate it right now. All right, here we go, firecracker. What do you mean? <laughs> We're gonna go down here in the shade so that you guys can see me a little bit better. Sorry about that whole sunlight thing. Jess, I'm gonna explain to you exactly how to do this trick so that there's no possible way that you could screw it up, okay? Even though you might. Just because it's a weird trick. But I think I have, I have confidence, I have faith. That he doesn't. <laughs> so here's what you did to do this trick. All you gotta do is when you're going up to the seventh stair, make sure you have a lot of speed and just manual down the stairs. I know that sounds really weird, but I swear that's exactly what you're supposed to do. Okay. Go for it. Oh, and also lean as far forward as you can, and I want you to turn your bars around so you're doing an X up while you go down. Okay? Deal. Now before we move forward, I want to fill you guys in on something. Just recently, I found a full stack of Night Llama stickers and I posted something on the at RaymondWarner.com Instagram asking you guys if you wanted me to make throwback sticker packs and we are. A lot of you guys said that you wanted to see that so we are going to be making throwback sticker packs that have the Night Llama stickers and I will give you guys a little bit more info on that when I figure it out. But first, let's see if Jess can get this first go. I think he's got it first go. Click that card if you guys agree with me. First, second, third, fourth, or fifth go. Click the card, go now. Yeah, that was sick. All right, Jess, round one, let's see it. Straight over towards that seven stair. Manny, ah! you did the last two. How is that even possible? Literally just gapped from the top of the set and went <laughs> Yo, go faster and don't be so afraid of dragging your wheel. You'll be just fine as long as you lean back, I swear. For the record, I didn't personally vote for the first try one. I'm going with third or fourth. I'm kind of torn between the two. I'm going to see how the second one goes and I'll let you guys know third or fourth. Jess over here learning a brand new scooter trick. The firecracker down the seven stair. Second go. Let's see if he's got it. Just did one! You literally just got one! Okay, remember what I just said before? Fourth try. Thank you. I haven't even done the third. Hey, at least I didn't say fifth. Yeah, but I'm on the third. I know that. Trust me. I'm well aware that you're on your third try. I don't think you're gonna get this try. I said fourth. This is just my personal vote. I'm just trying to win, okay? Third attempt. Oh, we're getting closer. Okay, now Jess, this is one you gotta land, otherwise you're gonna make me look stupid, okay? You gotta land it fourth try. Fourth try, otherwise I'm gonna be wrong on my own channel. Yeah. <laughs> Alright, I'm gonna demonstrate for Jess once again. Okay? Okay? If you don't land it this one, son, you're grounded. If you don't land this one, you're not going to Brad's house for a week. You understand? Okay, you're good. Go. No, you're not good. I'm just kidding. Jesus Christ. Freaking kids, man. Yes! <laughs> oh my gosh. Oh, the, oh the, dude, that was all bad. Almost died here, almost died there, and then you both almost died right there. Stop trying to gap the whole set. I'm trying. Jess, this is your fifth and final shot at this, and if you don't land it, you owe me 10 chicken wings. Deal. None of that Buffalo Wild Wings crap either. Wings and things, baby. God, the one that he lands. As soon as I say chicken wings, that's, that's where you really, that's where you go balls to the wall. As soon as I say chicken wings. Yeah. Okay, that makes sense. That does make sense. Okay. Well done. Thank you. Was that hard? No. No. It wasn't. It was scary. Or was it difficult? No. No. No, 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 no. If you guys go to your local street spot or local skate park and you guys try to do firecrackers, take a video of it, tag me in it so I can see yours. Jess, congratulations on the new learn. Well done, sir. Well done.
Okay, so let's start the sesh off with a line. Jess, give me a line really quick. I want to see whip invert, turn down over the box, double bar, front side 270 heel, scooter fake is still on the eight, down four. I'll try. All right, just so everybody knows, this is going to be a small whip invert. Now we got to get the turn down, double whip to bar. That was Nick's fault. Hell, that didn't work. Round two. You kidding me? Double whip bar I'm falling on. Like why am I falling on that trick on the easiest bank in the park? There we go, that was a good one. We'll get bar turned down. And double whip bar. Jesus, finally. All right, now 270 heel. Oh! I hit the backpack and still was able to land the scooter piggy. So a couple days ago, Steve-O learned backflip tuck no handers and he's going to show us. You can't us. even see the hands in the clip. Well, we're gonna not gonna be well now you have pressure, so now you have to get your hands off as far as you can. I'll try to do a better one. All right. I have no idea if I even got that clip, so I'm glad that he's doing a second one. Hey. What is going on? You didn't freaking land it, you kidding me? Yeah, you landed this shot, you got a full sned sticker. Oh. Yeah. Land it right now, Nate, you get a full sned sticker. You'll be part of the full sned squad. No, Boom. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Oh. <laughs> Boom. Made it. Okay, back to back flip whips, me and you. I'll okay. go first. All right, Ravens first. Flip, whip on the five. Steve-O coming down, getting a flip whip. Ah! <laughs> Whoa! What were you trying? Flip whip bar. <laughs> flip whip bar? Ah ha ha. I got your back, me and you. Hi, hi, hi. Aiden, Androck, Dan Schnicks. Oh. <laughs> yes, Michael, get you some. Oh. Oh. Yes. Yes. Boys. So we've got my scoot right here. It's been running kind of funny the past few days, and that's mainly because I haven't taken it apart and like kind of fixed it or anything like that. I think it's time to do that right now. Although, you guys have seen me build my scooter dozens of times here on the channel, so I figured it'd be kind of cool to have somebody else do it, and not just anybody else. I'm gonna find the youngest kid here at the skate park, which today is Michael. Michael's gonna build our scooter today, and no matter how it turns out, I gotta ride it. Now, before we move forward, Michael probably doesn't have that much experience in building scooters because he's a little kid, so we're gonna let him tighten it up completely by himself. I'm gonna give him pointers on how to do it, and once it's finished up, I have to do some tricks on it, like I said, no matter how it turns out. I'm gonna take this baby apart because that's probably a lot harder to do than put it back together. <laughs> okay, so we've got the entire scooter taken apart right here, just so you guys know. Um, I didn't take the wheel off on the fork because I really don't feel like there's anything wrong with that. So we left the wheel on the fork, but the back wheel is taken off and we have Michael right here. What is up, Michael? How's your day going, dude? Going good? What, how old are you? Six. Michael is six years old. Michael, how many scooters have you built in your entire life? One, uh, two, ten. Two. Perfect. So he's already ahead of the game. Actually one. One. He's built one scoot. Like I said, he's going to be the one hand tightening everything. He's going to do everything. I'm not going to touch the scooter. He's going to do everything from start to finish on his own. Sound good? Yeah. All right, Michael. Let's have you hop down right here, okay, dude? I like how every time I call you dude, it actually is extremely proper because of your shirt. Please. Yeah. So my friends uh, call my shirt a dude they when call they're you... not even call when they're not even saying to me. <laughs> Are they goofy? Yes. Yes. All right, so we're going to start out with the front end. So, Michael, here's how we're going to do this, okay? Do you know what this is called? Yes. What? Fork. My man. Okay, so pick the fork up right there, Michael. Like I said, I'm not doing any of this. You're doing everything, okay? Your hands are going to uh, get a little bit dirty, but I'll let you wipe them on my shirt later. I can wipe them on my own shirt. Oh! We're, we're going to do it like that? Yep. All right, perfect. Do you know how to put this together or no? Okay, go for it. All right, he's putting the headset. What now? Yeah, that one. He's got it on there. All right. What's next? Do you know what's next? All right, he's got that on there now. Do you know what to do with that top bolt? You do? Do you need a tool to tighten that? Uh, no. No? Okay, YOLO. Who needs tools when you got hands, right? And he's in. We're done. Okay, compression is put together, ready to go. All right, you want to put the handlebars on now? All right, sweet. Let's put the handlebars on. There you go, buddy. You want me to bring him down on the floor? Here, let me, yeah. Oh, oh God, he's going for it. <laughs> he can barely reach. Push. Oh, he's there. 22s, baby. Okay, now, do we need a tool? Oh, it's crooked. You want to put it on the floor or you got it? Uh, on the floor. 
Yeah, he wants to pull it. Okay, good. This one we need on the floor. Don't be scared. You're not going to hurt it. Now, do you need a tool to tighten that clamp? Uh, yeah, what tool do you need? He needs the Allen wrench. He's got that down. Are the bars straight? How are we looking? Yeah, they're, they're straight. My man. Michael's tightening that clamp up. Get real tight, man. Get those arms. Let me see those muscles. Boom. There you go. All right. Is that tight? Yeah, looks like it. Perfect. Oh, no. This still crooked. That's okay. We'll just we'll run it as it is. Now, what else do we need to put on there, Michael? Oh, are we back. missing something? Back wheel? You gotta put the brake on first. Perfect. Do you wanna put the scooter back on the top up there? Oh, uh, yeah. Let's do it. We've got the scoop back on the top of the eight foot quarter pipe right now. Oh yeah, Michael's got the slide in. Perfect. Is there a bolt for that? Which one fits? No, not that one. I think we just put this one. You think we just put that bolt in? Perfect, let's try that. Let's see if it works. All right, he's gonna put that bolt in there. He's gonna tighten it up. Oh, that one's a little too big. Perfect. He knows how the three-way works. Look at that beautiful vinyl grip tape in there too. You know what that brake is called? Do you know who yeah. makes that brake? Yeah. Take a guess. <laughs> Not me, no. That's an Envy brake, but I need a new one because I'm melting the tip of it. <laughs> I didn't even have to clamp my hand down because that vial grip tape is so good. You know what I'm saying? Get your vial grip tape wherever you can. Perfect. What else do we have to put on there? The back wheel. The back wheel. Perfect. So we just slide it in there and that's how it goes? How do we hold that wheel in there? I do not know. You don't know? Oh, he's going for the spacers. There we go. He's got a spacer on one side. Okay. Do you want me to hold the wheel still for you? We're letting Michael do this entire build by himself. So we've got a spacer going on the end of the bolt right now. He's going to try to slide that through for that axle. Let's see if that axle goes all the way through. Uh-oh. Got butterfingers. I didn't touch your butter at all today. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I didn't touch. He said I didn't touch any butter at all today. That's your, he's like, you're tripping. There's no butter on these fingers. Oh, look at that. We're through. Michael has done it. How do we hold that part on? Do you know? Let's try that. Almost. Try that one. See if that one works. Yeah, here we go. Here we go. That's what I'm talking about. Give me some nuts. Yeah, baby. All right, so now we have the nut on the bolt right now. We'll just hand tight it. Forget about it. Is it tight now? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's tight. The scoot is officially built. Michael built this entire thing by himself with pretty much... Uh-oh. We don't need that. We don't need that piece. Don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. It's just a headset. Good job, dude. My man, give me some nuts. What are you talking about, dude? Michael's gonna show us the skills that he's got on his scooter. I'm gonna get a couple clips on mine. Let's get some more clips on the GoPro. Michael said that he wanted to get a couple clips, so we're gonna film him doing a couple tricks on the hip right here. Here he comes, lots of speed, coming up. Whoa, do a jump right here. Perfect, do another one. You Dropping in right now. Let's see how this thing goes for the drop in. Oh my God. Oh man. Yeah, it works. Oh man. It's a little hard to keep it straight because there's no bottom headset. <laughs> you want me to tail up on it? Yeah. I'll do a tail up for you, okay? I mean, it, it definitely works. I mean, the bars aren't coming off. That's the one thing I had to make sure was that he tightened this clamp because if the bars fly off, I'm in big trouble. But the challenge is I want to see if I can flip this thing. That would be the, the, the ultimate challenge for me. If I can flip it, I'll be happy. Let's do the tail up first. Okay. Oh, I got the whip. There's no back spacers to the wheel, so the wheel just kind of does this so i just gotta get in the middle so it'll roll plenty of time has come let's see if we can get this if you fall on your knees that would be perfect yeah we'll try let's try not to fall at all let's just roll up to it first and see if i can keep the scooter straight enough to go upside down oh man i gotta i gotta flip it i gotta try to flip it it's just it's really hard to keep it straight because of you know this thing it's like sounding out here that sounds a little bad it sounds what's wrong with it Oh, noise, look. Sounds good to me. Sounds fine. <laughs> that sounds fine to you, right? No. <laughs> this is broken. No, that's not broken. Watch, I'm gonna back up it right now. Oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I was going up to it like a snake. Ladies and gentlemen. Michael is gonna be my new scoot builder. This is my boy. Thank you so much again, Michael. I appreciate you participating, building the scoot. You did a great job. And I'll have you do another one one of these days. Sound good? Six year old built my scoot. No problems whatsoever. I think he did, like I said, I think he did a great job, especially for this being only his second scooter to ever work on. And a lot of that stuff is really confusing. For example, the whole IHC compression, lots of scooter parts on this thing to put together into one build and he got it done. But uh, thank you guys so much for watching. And just like that, the vlog is over, so I'm out. Later. Can you feel it?